in our last lecture we have studied about the structures what is the need of a structure and how to declare the structure how to access the values of the members of the structure so in this video we will study about the nested structures what is the meaning of nested structure structures within the structures okay how to access the values of the nested structure so how to insert the values into the nested structure and how to access the values from the nested structures i am dr shriyash atri and these are the good engineering books from the s chan publishing nested structures structures that contains the another structure as its member is called nested structures so there are two types of structures one is embedded structure another is separate structure okay we need, there are two ways to do the nested structuring one is embedded structuring and another is by making the different or by making the separate structures so in this video we will focus on the embedded structure so this is the concept of embedded structure that means one structure declared inside the parent structure now what is the parent structure understand with the help of example so this is the structure employee this structure is having the members name address and employee id so this this is called parent structure now inside this structure we are declaring the another structure that is of date and this date is having the two members that is date of birth and date of joining that means employees date of birth and employees date of joining so we are inserting the uh, uh, date of birth and date of joining in the separate structure and that separate structure is embedded into the parent structure okay so this is called embedded structure so how to access the embedded structure from the parent structure let's understand with the help of a program okay and here understand this date underscore employee this is the variable to access the date structure and emp is a name of a variable which is used to access the employee structure and we will use these two variables for making the program let's do it now so student let's begin and understand the concept of embedded structure using the program okay so i am making a program to make you understand the embedded structure in which uh, my parent structure will be, will be the employee and the embedded structure will be the dates in which the member will be the date of birth and date of joining so let me declare first the structure parent structure is my employee okay and inside this we are having the members emp employee id which is of integer type care name okay i am taking the size array size is 20 and then okay <clears throat> now i am declaring the embedded structure inside this struct date and inside this i am saying date of care date of birth okay and then care the date of birth is also let me take its size is 10 and date of joining the size is also 10 okay now i am declaring the variable of this my variable name is d okay d means i am focusing for only on the dates and finally the parent variable name is emp okay
Now going inside the main, one by one we need to insert the value. So how to do that now? First of all, let me give you the statement printf. Enter the employee ID. Okay. Scanf. Employee ID is of integer type, so I am taking percentage percentage D, comma m percent. Now how to access the parent? Because employee ID is in the parent structure, so the variable of a parent structure is emp. Then dot operator and then uh, member that my member is emp i t. Okay. Then similarly, printf. Now we are going to insert the name of our employee. Enter the name of an employee. semicolon you need to put the semicolon after every statement scanf percentage d d comma then we have again so my name is of string type so we need to put the format specifier percentage s and comma emp dot name okay then this is how we need to insert the values into the parent employee id okay now we need to access the embedded structure so how to access the embedded structure again printf enter the date of birth scanf my date of birth is of string type so percentage s comma then first of all emp dot d dot d o b okay it is clear now so it is inside the parent structure so we need to write the variable of parent structure then dot operator then the variable of embedded structure and then dot uh, dot operator and then the member of embedded structure okay again we can write like that scanf percentage s comma employee dot d dot date of joining okay so this is the code just to take the values from the user okay now we need to print the values okay so how to print the values printf okay now name uh, first is employee id so we will write like that employee id is so we need to write the format specifier here and then comma where it is going to save my employee id is emp dot emp id okay now next statement is printf now we need to enter the name so name of an employee is 
which is of string type percentage s comma emp dot name then we need to print the date of birth of an employee so date of birth is which is again of string type percentage s comma how to access is again employee dot d dot d o b t o b then print f date of joining is percentage s comma emp dot d dot d o j okay so this is a program to take the values at a run time and then print in the embedded structure let's run it and check what is my output okay one thing while printing this we can print every value in a next line so we can write the next line here so that my output will give in the next line okay let's run it so this is the program we have written okay struct employee is an uh, parent structure and struct date is an embedded structure in which we are having inserting we are inserting the two values here but printing only the one to make you uh, to show you the difference okay so print of employee id we have done all these things we have inserting values of all the four members and displaying the values of three members okay let's see how it is going to take compile and run let's run it and check it now employee is 1 2 3 name of the employee is rahul and date of birth rahul is 0101 okay 1988 and date of joining is 2102 2001 okay so if now check it employee is 123 name of an employee is rahul and date of joining is 2102 2001 which we have entered so this is how it is accessing the members of the parent structure as well as the member of the embedded structure okay so you can complete this program and write the one extra line here and execute at your own and uh, try the execution process so this was all about the embedded structure in our next video we will study about the uh, how to do uh, the nested structuring using the separate structure these are the good engineering books from the s chan publishing i hope you are liking the videos so please do subscribe like and the permission of the copyright holder